look at what's inside this particular bag for the uh, Watts 800MQ. Okay, so we have a spring. This is the uh, uh, installation manual. Okay, so this is the, I think, freeze resistant kit. It doesn't say anything about being freeze resistant other than this FR maybe. Okay, so we have a spring, a rubber gasket, looks like a round rubber gasket. We have a piece of plastic with a red rubber o-ring and a some kind of brass insert in the middle this is a uh, some kind of part polycarbonate I think this goes in the uh, the bell area that's it so I got one two three four parts from this um, um, repair kit for the uh, Watts 800M4. Hi everyone welcome back to DIY Geek YouTube channel. Uh, in this video we're going to attempt to fix this Watts backflow preventer. This is the Watts 3 4 inch 800M4 backflow preventer. So despite the fact that I covered this with blankets and pipe covering actually two blankets during the uh, the Texas storm uh, in February we got really really cold and uh, it was all iced here and this guy still froze even though I bled the backflow preventer actually so anyways let me show you how it's leaking right now and uh, I think we have the kit to try to fix it so I'm gonna go ahead and turn it on uh, the water supply is coming from this pipe right here so I'm going to um, flip this on by switching it this way uh, oh man that's too hard okay I'm gonna turn it on turn the water on by flipping it vertical like this all right so as, as you can see uh, there's water dripping from all the way up here and then it's just gonna continuously drip and drip and drip so obviously something cracked uh, inside here so we got the uh, the kit right here to repair it already and um, I'm gonna show you right now what is included in that kit alright so we're gonna start repairing this the first thing we're gonna do is shut off the water next we are going to remove the cover using a Phillips screwdriver there is two screws up here okay so um, I was trying to remove this by turning it uh, counterclockwise and as you can see I broke this plastic part completely um, it's not supposed to be that hard to remove so now I have no choice but to uh, try to destroy this entire thing here so that we can screw in a new one that is there all right
Okay, that took a long time for us to remove that that piece, and uh, because it was it was stuck. Uh, so finally, we're able to remove this this piece right here. I don't know what it is, but I think we have a replacement for all of these things. And um, yeah, unfortunately, I have to destroy this entire thing here because it just would not screw out. Um, all right, so we're gonna try to assemble this in the reverse way that we disassemble it and see if we can properly uh, put everything back. Okay, so we are going to drop this white plastic piece uh, inside just like that and put the spring right on it. Okay, so I forgot to put the rubber ring uh, and the rubber ring is supposed to go around at this black plastic part um, and all the way at the bottom or towards the top actually so it should be pushed all the way towards the top like that okay all right so let's try to put it back on again uh, let's not forget the spring Now I'm going to turn it on again and hopefully it doesn't leak. Perfect. No leak. Okay, so right now we're ready to, uh, to turn on, I'm sorry, to, to put on the cap now. Okay, well that's it folks. Uh, we just replaced all the internals and this is the uh, supposed to be the frozen resistant version uh, I'm gonna put the uh, the link in the description where you can buy uh, this particular kit sorry about forgetting the uh, o-ring or the rubber ring it was leaking but we got it fixed anyway so it's all good to go and um, if you want to buy this uh, retrofit with the uh, frozen resistant I'm gonna put the link in the description and uh, please use my link if you find this video useful please give it a thumbs up and if you like this kind of content please subscribe to my channel thank, thank you, you for watching please subscribe to my channel to see more do-it-yourself video like these and support my channel thank you